All right, guys, this one here is uh, going to be a little bit off topic, but uh, we find all kinds of really interesting rocks and minerals and things uh, in the back of the property. And uh, I don't know if these things are agates or if they're just uh, uh, opal that uh, doesn't have any color in it or something, but these are found in the basalt. And I'll kind of go over um, and we'll look at them. Hopefully you guys can help me identify them. And uh, I do, ha I, some of them I have polished up here on the top. And then I'll show you what they look like here in the raw. Um, these things are like, they form in the basalt and they're real like bubbly. They're almost just kind of like an opaque glass maybe. And they form in big nodules in the basalt. And uh, they go everything from real blobular and like sandy, like pockmark, like they almost formed and cooled around like pockets of sand or aggregate. And uh, to these real smooth edges on them. Uh, some of them are kind of pocketed. You can see here how it's kind of concave. Like it grew in a pocket. Uh, a lot of them are just perfectly circular. Yeah, this one is even hollow. You can see a little bit of like color in this one. When you find a lot of them, they just almost just look like dirty rocks. Some of them have kind of a blue tint. This one's really, really white. And uh, we, we polish some of these to just see what they are. And they come out real, real clear, a little bit of polishing compound in them. Some of them are like a real dingy kind of a yellow color. And you can see the big bubbles there where like they formed around harder material or something. Um, this one's real crystally looking. You can see how it's kind of got a shape to it. But they form in like big nodules in the basalt. And some of these are, are more clear. And, and may I hold one up to the light and you guys can, let's see if you guys can help me identify them. I don't know. A little more clear. Have a tiny bit of like play of color. They're kind of like that. <clears throat> Some of them are just loaded with weird inclusions and stuff. Almost like uh, not quite bubbles, but like a like a white kind of calcite or calcium looking stuff. But some of them polish up really nice. They're real and they're real clear. It's almost just like white glass. This one has a lot of like the white inclusions. Here's one that's just very milky in color. And you can see the difference in, in the edge of that one. And you can see just how milky in color they are. But you can see through them. You know, they're kind of translucent. But uh, we've polished lots and lots of them, but hopefully you guys can maybe help me identify what these are. Uh, I thought maybe they were almost like, you know, we find a lot of black obsidian, and this kind of reminded me of, you know, like a volcanic glass, except it's clear or opaque. And it forms in these pockets, in these nodules on the side of the basalt. And then as the exposed basalt weathers and weathers away, there'll be little holes in the basalt and these things will kind of be laying all around the main basalt piece where they have weathered out over the years. So maybe you got some geologists out there. Help me, help me get an idea of what these things are. All right, guys, this is Chet. Hey, thanks for watching.